I've never in the history of Neverdom seen an uh, artist beef with their fans. Hardcore beef, cussing them out, dragging them through the dirt, mud, all of it. I ain't never seen that shit. Like, you're such a fucking idiot. I'm not your friend. Let's watch some crazy stuff, yo. Y'all, before we start this video, I just need to go ahead and let y'all know, yes, there's something on the side of my mouth, and it's called toothpaste, so please do not be dragging me. Also, I might sound like Marge Simpson or something. That's because it's 6 o'clock in the morning, and my voice haven't got right yet, okay? So, yeah, I kind of sound like Debo, but leave me alone. Thank you. What's good, y'all? It's your real too real. We are back up in this thing with another video, and today, we're going to be talking about Doja Cat. Cause I just had a scary ass dream and Doja was in it and yeah, yeah. The way she been going off on her fans, like her fans is not the ones that pay the bill. Like sis, they're paying your bills. You need to at least be a little nice. Cause you don't want to be on skid row. I had seen this TikTok where it was a picture of Doja. She had posted it was black, right? And then they started lighting the picture and it was her like spit blood out looking like a little Eminem because you know she got a little little bald head now. She looked like a little Eminem. And she had blood coming in her mouth and I was like, she was dragging the shit out of what do, what do they call themselves? The kitties, the kittens. You're an idiot. I don't care if you like my music or not. There's a lot of people I don't like who I fucking listen to their music and shit. And there's a lot of people I don't know that I listen to their music and shit. And if I knew them, I probably wouldn't fucking like them. I listen to a lot of music. And there's no way I would be best friends with every fucking person that I listen to their fucking music. Do you understand? Like, not trying to be, like, aggressive towards you, but, like, I am because I'm upset with you. But, like, do you understand what I'm saying? Amongst all the anger. Like, you're such a fucking idiot. I'm not your friend. I make fucking music and you like it. And if you don't, cool, great, I don't give a shit. I'm not doing it so that you like me. I'm doing it because it's fun. Now fucking hop off my cock, you Philistine piece of shit. No one fucking cares. Bye, pussy bitch. They also, we talk about her boyfriend, who looked like a math teacher. Yeah, they said that he a little pervy perv. But they're basically saying that um, he has victims. And I'm like, victims? Because let me tell you, um, when I see that, I'm just like, at first I was like, okay, you know, I'm too tired to be making up stuff. So you just be like, okay, whatever. But I keep seeing it more and more and more. So I'm like, they're not feeling her attitude. They're not feeling her boyfriend. Who looked like he could be a sugar daddy? She lost 400,000 uh, followers on Instagram the other day. Ooh, she dull. She a bad little she rebel. Like people is not liking that she's references the devils in her songs anymore. It's like they're they're not feeling that, and that's understandable because the you know Doja, woman Doja, juicy Doja, juicy is really when I fell in love with Doja. So I was like. Okay, that's my beach. But now it's like I don't know what's going on. It's blood everywhere. It's spiders everywhere. She has a math teacher banging her back out. Like and then her fans keep telling her, Hey, we we don't like him. Like, he got victims that don't spoke out and you ain't spoke about nothing. Nathan. They ain't having that. So I just hope Doja can find herself again. I hope she go back to the Doja that we like because this little dark entity, she be scared to listen to Doja in my house for some shit come up in here and start opening my damn cabinets and shit. Have me down moving a tissue when I'm trying to use the bathroom. I, I ain't doing it, okay? So I just hope Doja will go back to the Doja that we like or at least just chill out on the blood and the demonic shit. And stop disrespecting your fans, baby, because I have never, in the history of Neverdom, seen an uh, artist beef with they fans. Hardcore beef, cussing them out, dragging them through the dirt, mud, all of it. I ain't never seen that shit. <laughs> and those are the first one to show me that motherfuckers do not give a shit. Okay, let's say Cardi B 
be arguing and beefing with her fans because they said they want an album. Okay. And then she be saying, like, go get in a car wreck, go do all this crazy stuff. I'm like, okay, wow. And then there's Doja. She's like, bitch, I don't give a fuck about you. <laughs> I don't even know you. But let me know what y'all think in the comments about Doja Cat. I know I'm just sitting here holding this coffee. I ain't, I ain't trying to burn my lip and embarrass myself. Because it's clear that she is not the same Doja from Woman and Juicy and Options. It's, she's not the same. Okay? Let me know what y'all think about her. Let me know what y'all think about her math teacher. Boom. That's breaking her dick out. Let me know in the comments. Like and subscribe. It's your girl. Let's like, see real up out this thing. Let's watch some crazy stuff, yo.